Hello, my name is Jenny Fang, and in this tutorial, I would like to give you an overview of the main functions of our commissioning software Centron PowerConfig. On the left side, you can see the device library. All Centron devices from measuring devices to molded case circuit breakers are listed here. In this column, information of the respective product can be retrieved by the information symbol I. PowerConfig supports only Centron devices via Modbus RTU, TCP, and Profinet, as well as Profibus. To create a new project, go to the Properties. There you can insert all the necessary data. Here the project is assigned the name Building1 and the planner John Doe. To add devices to the project, two ways are available. The first one is manually adding the devices by drag and drop. In this example, Power Center 3000 is dragged into the project bar and a pack 4200 is appended. Afterwards, different categories appear, which can also be seen here. Depending on the device, different numbers of selection options are displayed. The first five categories are relevant for commissioning. The remaining ones are additional features, which can be quite useful. First, parameters are assigned to the measuring device. Since this pack measures at Transformer 1, it is given the name Transformer 1. Then the communication is selected in the selection and the device address is added. In this scheme, relevant data like the IP address are maintained. By ping, the accessibility of the device can be determined. If this is successful, all parameters can now be written down by loading into device. PowerConfig allows to copy and paste devices in the project itself. This is advantageous if there are several similar devices with almost the same parameters within a power distribution. When copying and pasting the pack 4200, you are asked whether all values should be adopted. Here again, a selection can be made. In this example, however, all values are taken over and only the port of Transformer 2 is changed. The second one is the import-export function. Existing devices, for example, from other applications, like Simaris Design, can be taken over, including protection parameters. Or already stored devices can be inserted with the import function. To do this, select the required device and right-click to export it and save it as a template with all the data entered. In order to use it again, it is sufficient to click on the project in which it is to be integrated. The export function is selected for this purpose. Also, in this function, a pop-up window appears with the question whether all values are to be taken over. Next, we have the comfort functions. In the parameter area, there are additional functions on the right side of the upper bar. The first one is the online-offline comparison. If you notice that the system works differently or does not work as it should, then there is the possibility to view what was once set in the project and which settings are now present in the device itself. By clicking on the filter, the filter function is started, which shows all changes. The second one is the device comparison. If one subsystem works and the other does not, although they are similar, those devices can be compared with each other. For example, Transformer 1 and Transformer 2. By selecting the filter function, only the differences can be shown. In this example, the difference is in the name. This function is especially helpful during commissioning or troubleshooting. For illustration, a COM800 is attached to the PowerCenter 3000. Two molded case circuit breakers 3VA are subordinated to this. Additionally, a Power Center 1000 with a 5SL COM MCB is pulled into the project. This is how an exemplary power distribution could look like. The entire device combination can now be saved as a project. This means that a file is generated which can then be used freely, for example, to work on it together with colleagues or simply to insert it back into PowerConfig later. In the Options tab, the language can be changed. 
Currently, 10 languages are available. Another function is the setting of the face display for America. Temperature settings from Celsius to Fahrenheit. With the function project documentation, the entire power distribution or parts of it can be saved as a PDF. It is necessary to select the devices that need to be documented. After that, a preview will be created. On the right side in the properties, you can find more selection choices. Afterwards, all data of the power distribution are listed and the file can be exported. I hope I was able to give you an insight into the main functions of Centron PowerConfig and simplify the commissioning of your device or power distribution.